Most dangerous animals look the part, which is very fortunate for us because we basically stay as far away from them as possible based on looks alone. Some, on the other hand, hide behind facades that is the exact opposite of dangerous, but turned out to be quite the killers. Those animals are going to be the focus in today's video. From the weirdest looking animal you've ever seen to the deadliest creature in Australian waters, here are animals that are way more dangerous than they look. Number 10. The Duck-Billed Platypus If there's one thing that we can all agree on is that platypuses sure do look weird. In fact, the first scientist to examine one believed they were being hoaxed. It can be described as a hodgepodge of parts from various, more normal-looking animals. It would have the duck for its bill and webbed feet, the beaver for its tail, and the otter for its body and fur. Sometimes it's even been shown to wear a detective hat. These semi-aquatic creatures are perfectly built for life in water. They have webbed feet that allow them to swim effortlessly, while steering is done by its beaver-like tail. Folds of skin cover their eyes and ears to prevent water from entering, and the nostrils close with a watertight seal. In this posture, a platypus can remain submerged for a minute or two and employ its sensitive bill to find food. But hidden underneath this goofy facade is something that can be potentially dangerous. They actually have spurs near their heels that can inject deadly poison. They are one of the extremely few venomous mammals, and scientists still do not understand why and how the platypus developed in such a way. It may not be deadly, per se, to us humans, but to something like your pet dog who gets a little too close, yeah, you might want to be careful. Number 9. The Koala Arguably the world's cutest animal, it's extremely hard to believe that koalas have a hidden dark side. These teddy bear-like marsupials can be most often seen hugging eucalyptus trees and spend their days sleeping and feeding, but mostly sleeping. By snoozing up to 22 hours a day, koalas take laziness to an entirely different level. However, even these lethargic creatures can snap sometimes, and that's when they bring out their violent side. While koala on koala violence is generally pretty mild, they have been known to go after dogs and even humans. Number 8. The Fire Salamander an amphibian mostly found in European countries, fire salamanders are beautiful animals famous for their superb black and yellow colorations. And also sometimes they come in red and orange. They can be awesome pets given their lifespan of up to 50 years. In fact, there are already people who do have them as pets. The thing is, taking a creature such as a fire salamander as a pet has an underlying danger. The fire salamander's skin is covered with a toxin which it secretes from glands located just under the skin. The toxin attacks the victim's central nervous system directly and can cause a variety of problems. This includes uncontrollable muscle convulsions and hypertension. Needless to say, the toxin is extremely harmful to us humans. In the animal kingdom, bright colorations usually are a sign of danger, and this fact can't be true enough for this dangerous amphibian. Still a good pet, though. Number 7. Dolphins Some of you might be surprised to see dolphins on this list, but me? No, not even close. Scientists already had their suspicions all the way back in the 90s, but these guys are actually extremely dangerous creatures. To tell you the truth, dolphins can be indiscriminate killers that kill other sea creatures for no apparent reason other than fun. Scientists found out about this violent behavior when the battered corpses of hundreds of porpoises and baby dolphins started washing up on both sides of the Atlantic. They eventually concluded that it was male dolphins who were slaughtering other dolphins, including their own babies, just because they could. This was especially alarming back then because during that time, dolphin tourism was pretty much on the rise and unregulated, leading to a spokeswoman from the National Marine Fisheries to liken these marine animals to a time bomb waiting to go off. If that wasn't bad enough, dolphins have sexually assaulted divers and swimmers on numerous occasions and have been known to play their version of volleyball using baby sharks as the balls. Yeah, you're not gonna look at Flipper the same again, I can tell you that much. Number 6. The Beaver Those bug teeth aren't only for chewing on wood. These cute animals are nocturnal and are native to North America and Eurasia. And unless you've been living under a rock all your life, you all know that these animals are famous for building dams which they call their homes. People have always tried to domesticate the beaver. Problem is, they don't take too kindly to being domesticated. Take them out of their natural habitat and they start getting aggressive. They're even more prone to attack when they're infected with rabies, which they often are. When scared, they will attack humans, and another thing, they're capable of attacking people both in land and water. 
Their trademark sharp front teeth can easily pierce the skin and flesh of victims. Their bites can sometimes cause damage to the arteries, which, as doctors will tell you, are not something that you would want to happen to you, because it won't end well. Number 5. The Giant Panda Pandas are the pose of children of wildlife conservation, and it's not hard to see why. Those cute round faces, big dark patches that make their eyes look bigger, and childlike curiosity, it's no wonder we love them. Add on top of that their seemingly lazy attitude to eating. Sitting on their bottoms with their legs sticking out while chewing fistfuls of bamboo, it only makes them more endearing. It's actually easy to forget that these are still wild animals, and wild bears for that matter, and that makes them very, very dangerous. Pandas actually have one of the most powerful bites of any mammal. Their paws are also tipped with six large claws, and yes, pandas have six fingers, which are both dexterous and capable of delivering a formidable swipe. And contrary to popular belief, they do not subsist on bamboo alone. In the wild, they are partial to a bit of meat to supplement their otherwise vegetarian diet, often killing and eating small mammals. And I'm sure if they're hungry enough, they wouldn't hesitate to go after you. Number 4. The Kandiru The Kandiru is a tiny parasitic catfish that has a tendency to find its way into undesirable places in order to suck an organism's blood. They're not picky when it comes to hosts, so humans are an open target. With a burst of energy, they propel their way into an opening, and once they're in, they get themselves launched into place with the sharp backward-pointing spines. From here, the fish happily feeds on the organism's blood. The thing is, the Kandiru will try any and every opening to get into a host's body. A lot of people claim that they are attracted to the smell of urine and will make a beeline to the source of the smell. In other words, once the source of the smell is located, it is said that fish swim up through the stream of urine coming from the urethra and head into the organism's urinary tract. Ooh, that hurts me. Once it's made its residence, it stays there, and the only way to actually remove it is through surgery. Once again, ooh. Number 3. The Prairie Dog If you think that dolphins are surprising killers, wait till you find out what prairie dogs can do. As it turns out, these small mammals don't take too kindly to competition. Researchers found out that white-tailed prairie dogs routinely hunt and slaughter ground squirrels, which they compete for resources with. The prairie dogs are plant eaters, so once they've bitten the squirrels to death, they just drop the dead bodies and walk away. Researchers were understandably shocked when they first observed this behavior, which also has been recorded on camera. Now it's time for the day's best pick. Today's best pick is an animal that certainly looks dangerous, has a name that sounds dangerous, but is it really dangerous? Yes, yes it is. Find out more next with number two, the alligator snapping turtle. I don't think any other words can describe the alligator snapping turtles better than dinosaur-like. This is because of their spiky shells and primitive looking faces. They have three pointed ridges along their shells that run from head to tail, and unlike all other species of snapping turtle, this one has eyes on the sides of its head. The alligator snapping turtle is the largest species of freshwater turtle. Males typically weigh between 155 to 175 pounds. They are found exclusively in the United States, from northern Florida to eastern Texas and as far north as Iowa. They're almost exclusively aquatic and tend to stay submerged and motionless for so long that algae begins to grow on their shells. They can go 50 minutes before needing to service for a gulp of air. Except for egg-laying females, these turtles almost never come on land. There are myths that say the alligator snapping turtles are known to attack people, but there's simply no truth in that. When I said they were dangerous, I only meant they have the capacity so. They do have a bite force of up to a thousand pounds, which can literally snap human bones in half. This, of course, means that anybody getting bit by these prehistoric jaws is definitely going to have a bad day. Before we move on, do me a favor. My analytics show that only about 15% of you watching are actually subscribed. Come on, guys, what's up with that? Can you guys please hit the subscribe button? You guys watch my videos every day anyway, so you might as well subscribe and keep up to date with every video we put out. Number 1. The Box Jellyfish Is there anything more innocuous looking than a floating piece of jelly? That preconception is the reason why the box jellyfish tops today's list. In fact, in Australia, these floating pieces of jelly are responsible for more human deaths than snakes, sharks, and saltwater crocs combined. One box jellyfish contains enough venom to kill up to 60 people, what makes them even more dangerous is the speed at which their venom acts inside a human body. The sting of a box jellyfish can kill you in less than five minutes. 
Unlike other jellyfishes floating with the currents, these fellows can swim, making a run-in with the divers more likely. Other traits that set them apart from other jellyfish is their ability to see. They have clusters of eyes on each side of their box-shaped body. These abilities support the belief that instead of waiting for food to bump into their tentacles, box jellyfish might hunt for prey. Fortunately for divers, their menu mainly consists of shrimp and not humans. Which dangerous entry in our list did you find surprising? Let us know down below in the comments. Also make sure to check out the channel's other amazing content. As always, thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next time. Later everybody.